Next, this is one of the big items that Drew got from my mom. Um, she also got, my mom also got these for my dad as well. He has one that he uses every day as his main wallet, and it's a metal wallet. my channel or welcome if you're new here. In this video I'm going to be filming what I got my husband for Christmas or a men's gift guide, whatever you want to call it. So I'm going to show you everything that I got my husband for Christmas, a couple things that my mom got him for Christmas and that his mom got him for Christmas, and also I will be showing all of his stocking stuffers. This year we decided to do stocking stuffers for each other. We thought that would be really fun. But I'm excited to show it all and give you guys some ideas if anyone needs an extra idea for a man in their life. If you're wondering if this is going to ruin the surprise for Christmas for Drew, it's not because I've already made sure that he would not watch this. And I turned the bell off on his YouTube account so that he is no longer getting notifications from my channel until Christmas. If you guys are new to my channel, make sure that you subscribe before you leave and make sure that you give this video a thumbs up to let me know that you like this kind of content. And also, I just wanted to mention, if you're new to my channel and you're wondering why I'm filming in front of my daughter's crib for my husband's video, um, this is the only space that I have in my house that is clean enough to film right now, and this is where I usually film my sit-down videos. The first thing that I got him and the biggest gift that I got him was a Yeti cooler. So I don't have that cooler in here because it's way too big to carry in here to film this video, but I will, I think you guys probably saw it in the thumbnail, and I will try to get a video of it to insert in here. It was $350, but I did get it on sale for 20% off. I got the Desert Tan one, and it's the Tundra 65 Yeti cooler. So he got the biggest one, and that was his big gift. He, that was for birthday and for Christmas, and he also put some money towards it that he got from his grandpa for Christmas. I think I ended up spending like 100 on for his birthday and 100 for Christmas. I can't remember how it all worked out and what the total price was after the discount, but that's how I was able to still get him more things, and I'm showing you some of the stuff that my mom got him as well. So the next idea, I mean, it kind of goes along with that. This Yeti Rambler, it's 26 ounces, and this isn't his actually. This is one that my mom had that she's giving to someone as a gift, but she thought that I should put these in my video because she thought it would make a good idea for a men's gift guide. So she gave me these and told me to take them to my house for my video. So this is the um, Yeti Rambler mug, 14 ounces. Is this one, this is actually for my brother for Christmas. And it also goes with this Milwaukee flashlight. We draw names in our family because there are five kids and then four significant others. So that's nine kids total that we would have to get presents for everyone. So instead of doing that, we draw names so each sibling gets one other sibling and we only have to buy for one person. So Drew got Luke and I picked him out this because if I wouldn't have got this for Luke, Luke would not have probably got a present until the day of the party. And it would have been a gift card probably. So you're welcome, Luke. I got you these two things. I hope you're not watching, though. Next, this is one of the big items that Drew got from my mom. Um, she also got, my mom also got these for my dad as well. Um, but he won't be watching this, so he won't hopefully get the surprise round. They're called the Diamondback Binocular 10 by 42 whatever that means. For some reason, my dad and Drew both wanted these. And my mom got them for both of them, so... They both got these, and they were from Cabela's on Black Friday for, I believe, um, $120, but they're more expensive. They were on sale as a doorbuster, so she got two pair of those. Another great idea, and this is something that my mom got for a guy in her life. I'm not going to say who because if they sneak and watch this video, I don't want them to know. But she got this Ridge wallet. Drew already has one of these, so I did not get one of these for him this year. He has one that he uses every day as his main wallet, and it's a metal wallet. It's very thin, and this one is the aluminum gunmetal one, and it's on the website The Ridge that you can purchase them. I'll link it in the description box below in case you're interested, but my dad has one and Drew has one, and my brother-in-law has one, and he loves it as well. 
They have some for as low as $65, I want to say. I don't know how much this one was exactly, but I think this is a very nice gift. It's kind of unique because you don't see these every day. I've never seen a metal wallet except for this Ridge wallet, so it's really cool. Also, I got him a couple clothing items. I got him this really nice flannel from Express. It's a very thick, heavy flannel, so I really like that. And I got this on Black Friday, so it was 50% off. So it ended up being about $30. In clothing, I don't really count that as much out of his Christmas budget because he really needed clothing, so I'm just like wrapping an extra present kind of. And also he got this North Face quarter zip. He saw this at North Face. I think it was only, I want to say it was like $25. It was on sale for Black Friday, and it's a fleece one. So it's really nice, um, and he really wanted this, so I had to get it for him. He already knows about the North Face. Um, I don't think he saw the flannel yet, but I think he knows I got him a flannel, so it doesn't really matter. Next, I got him this North Face hat. He's obsessed with hats, and he doesn't know about this one. I'm kind of excited about this because he loves hats, and I thought this color was really nice. He loves this color. It's kind of like an olive green. And he has a sweatshirt this color, and I thought he would really like this. I also got him a tie from Express, and I will show you that here. I love this. He helped me pick it out. It wasn't going to be one of his Christmas presents, but then I had to return something at Express, and I could only exchange it because it, I didn't have a receipt for it, so I exchanged it for this tie for him. And I think it's really cute. If you look closely, it's black, and it has little silver flowers floral pattern. So it looks really nice and he's planning on wearing it with either his gray dress shirt or his gray, black, or white. I think it would look really nice with either and I thought this was a good idea for a gift. A tie for a man in your life. So then before we get to the stocking stuffers, this is the last gift and it is a pair of slippers from Sorel. So I'm going to show you them does not know about these and I think he's going to be really surprised. I hope he likes them and I hope they fit him or else we'll have to exchange them. But this is what they look like. They were, I want to say, $65 and this is what they look like. I almost caught them in black but I decided on this color. I don't know. He's an old man at heart so if these look like old man slippers to you that would probably be a compliment to him but I thought they were really cute. And my mom got these for my dad, too. I just had to look out the window to make sure he was not on his way home. He's picking up Bryn right now from his mom's because she stayed the night there last night. So we could go Christmas shopping, and I'm filming this video before he gets back. Now diving into his stocking stuffers, which I'm excited about because I really wanted to do a stocking for him this year. I got him this Yeti beverage holder to go on his Yeti cooler. So it attaches to the side. Let me see if there's a picture. Oh, yeah, there is. So you screw it in on the side of your cooler, and you can put your drink in it. And he had said that he wanted this to go with his Yeti, so I don't know if he knows that I got it for him or not because I didn't say I did. So I think he'll be kind of surprised when he opens it. And then, of course, I got him beef jerky to go in his stocking because every guy needs beef jerky in their stocking. And, of course, I had to get him some candy, so I got him some gum and some candy. And I also got him some more candy. He, these are his favorite, so I had to get him some sweet tart ropes and some Jolly Ranchers. And some airheads. I also got him this knife and flashlight set from Cabela's, which is really cute. And it comes in a waterproof case. So this is waterproof. Here, let me see if it opens. Oh, it has tape on it, but it's waterproof, so you could keep other things in it too. And it would be nice um, when you go hunting, if there's any way that your stuff could get wet or something. I don't know. So, Or if you're going canoeing or something. Who knows? I just thought it was kind of cool. It was a doorbuster on Black Friday for $10, so I picked it up for his stocking. He's obsessed with flashlights and um, knives. And also, I was going to get him this for his stocking, but my mom got him this for Christmas, so um, this would also be a good stocking stuffer. And I got him a $25 Cabela's gift card, because although I bought this with our money, 
um, which is kind of pointless. I thought it would be kind of cool because he would have to spend it at Cabela's and then he wouldn't feel like he's spending extra money. It's kind of like one of his presents, so I got him this. One last thing that I got him, which might seem kind of cheesy, but to him I know he's going to like it because um, for one it says something about being a dad and for two he loves coffee mugs and he thinks... He loves looking at the coffee mugs in TJ Maxx when we go, and he's asked before for me to get him a cool coffee mug sometime. Um, but that was months ago, so he won't have an idea that I got this for him. But it says, best dad ever, and it's black and tan, so I think it's really cute and subtle. And then the inside's white. So, so cute. So that is everything that I got for him. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up and make sure you're subscribed to my channel before you leave. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. So that is everything that I got for him. And now I'm going to wrap all of his stocking stuffers.
So I just finished wrapping all your stocking gifts, and now I'm going to stuff his stocking. I have a feeling that everything is not going to fit, so I might have to save some of the gifts out. enough to fit but it doesn't look quite like a stocking anymore um that's gonna have to do that is going to be all for this video thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you leave and make sure and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and i will see you guys in the next video bye